What's up everyone? Hope you're doing well. Today we have part two of our 2022 Heritage High Number rip of our case. So we'll be doing two more boxes um, and we'll see what we get. So we're going to get onto our box topper here. In the last video that was a, uh, a buyback. So I've learned that since then when it has the uh, little stamp on it. Man, struggling to get that open. When it has a stamp on it, that means they bought it back from somebody and then they're putting it back into circulation. And look at this. We got a Mike Schmidt autograph. Wow. <laughs> what? That's crazy. Mike Jack Schmidt. Awesome. On card autograph. They got it in the uh, nice wrapping and everything. Nice and protected. What a great way to start off uh, box number three here so yeah we will definitely set that aside and keep that protected um and here we go here's some speed ripping all right and pause again here for our box number top excuse me box topper number two let's see what we get um probably not gonna be an autograph <laughs> Like Mike Schmidt, I have to imagine those are extremely rare to get an autographed box topper. We get Giancarlo Stanton with the uh, fake auto there. So there's that, and back to speed ripping. All right, so here we are with our another stack of glorious packs. Definitely have to put Mr. Mike Schmidt up here somehow we'll just have him balancing there that is uh amazing so we already hit a uh, red ink auto last video we got a um, marcus Semyon numbered to 73 and now we have a mike schmidt so i'm gonna do this a little differently i'm just gonna open all the packs and put them um all together in one stack because Otherwise, it just takes too long, and it's like half an hour long. Um, so, <clears throat> excuse me. So, I'm going to start stacking these up, and uh, we'll go back into speed ripping mode now. All right, so here is our nice stack of cards. We'll go ahead and just do half of it here see how we do so we got Piguero there's a Nick Cassianos Spencer Torkelson rookie very nice um, did see that Jackson Holiday got called up today at his uh, major league debut had a couple strikeouts an error I think and uh, so it wasn't the greatest start for him but that's okay. They're not all awesome openers. Um, but he's going to have a great uh, career, I'm sure. There's Brandon Marsh, rookie. Very nice. MJ Melendez. Uh, let's see. Clint Fraser. There's uh, Seiya Suzuki, rookie. Still looking for those Bobby Witts and J Rod rookies. There's a nice Mackenzie Gore, rookie card. Numbered to 999. Get a uh, stand up for that one. But yeah, I'm just, once that uh, once Jackson Holiday gets going and the Orioles get their offense in sync, they're going to be nearly unstoppable. It seems like such a stacked team. All right, let's see. Josh Reddick. So I'm not too familiar with all of these yet, so I'm not going to be able to pick out the short prints right away so this Matt Olson we're gonna have to I'll have to go through and and look and see if any of them have the uh, the image or the error logo name whatever it is next to the baseball there another Nolan Ryan insert so we're gonna be moving through this quicker there's Hunter Green rookie 
Uh, let's see. Royce Lewis. Very nice. That just reminds me of a uh, Riley Green for some reason. Obviously, they don't look the same, but it was the same kind of pose for Heritage 2023. What about you guys? Have you been getting any Heritage 2024? I just got... Uh, a, uh, a few monster mega boxes myself. So I'll be um, getting those in the near week or so. So, all right, time to rip the next stack. Alright, so here comes the next stack. Anyway, um, Heritage 2024. I um, ordered a few monster mega boxes of that, whichever it is. Um, so I'll be looking forward to that. I actually watched, um, there's a George Kirby rookie. And then there's a Bobby Witt. I watched Jabs rip a case of it. And I think he either had one auto or zero autos out of a whole case. And the rest were just patches. So... And that was hobby boxes, so I don't know. I mean, maybe hobby boxes, and it's not the way to go. But look at this. We have a Jose Altuve, real auto, on card. Awesome. So this is uh, our third auto. So we already hit our goal for autographs, which is nuts. I I didn't think I saw a uh, jersey cards in here. So we have three autos. That's Jose Altuve, Marcus Semyon, and Mike Schmidt. What a nice looking card. Um, man, that's amazing. So these, uh, this case is delivering. So I don't know. I mean, I have to assume obviously that all these cases aren't that good because this, this has been an amazing case so far. There's Bryson Stott. Um, anyway, yeah, so I'm not sure if the hobby odds are just not great or, um, or something, but I know with the um, there's Spencer Strider who's uh, hurt right now. I know with uh, the monster boxes, at least you're guaranteed three extra parallels. And I have seen some uh, uh, autographs, some patches coming out of those. So I don't know. We'll see. I've got to watch some more rips of it, but I won't be going all out on it. And there's a J-Rod. So we got our J-Rod and Bobby Witt so far. And this is just one box. I mean, that's nuts. Maybe we can get one more numbered card. There's Jeremy Pena. Hopefully he can pick it up. Alec Thomas, rookie. Keston Hira. Bryce Elder. A lot of good rookies in this set. Vladdy Jr. Jamai. And let's see. Two Cutter Crawfords there. Um, and that's going to be it for this box. So uh, I'm going to do a quick check now for image variations. So we'll go ahead and speed this up. Whoop, got a little camera bump. There we go. So maybe it's just me, but um, I haven't seen any of these um, image variations or error or logo or team uh, next to this baseball here. I mean, pretty sure that's where it's supposed to be, but uh, yeah, I mean, obviously we've got the hits to, you know, set that offset that, but all right, here we go. Next pack, uh, the Hobby Box 1, great success. Look at that display there. Uh, got one numbered card, and then Bobby Witt and J-Rod Rookie. Uh, but uh, here we go. All 
All right, so stack uh, number three, starting hobby box number four. Let's get into it. See how we do in this box. Now, definitely expecting a patch this time around. There's no way you can have another auto in the same box or in another box right after. Spencer Strider, rookie, very nice. Let me know if you see any other rookies that you think are notable or any short prints you think I might miss. Like I said before, I have not ripped much of this product. But there's a J-Rod right there. I know that's not a variation. All right, let's see. This one is upside down. Rookie performer CJ Abrams. Very cool. Not sure why. Rice, Royce Lewis. It's one nice thing that I saw about 2024 Tops Heritage is that every short print is um, backwards. Like the uh, 1 to 100. And then every um, variation or error card is backwards. So I think we did a good job this year around, or this time around. All right, so not much going on for this first stack so far. There's Hunter Green, Seiya Suzuki. Oh, no, flip, flip. Let's see. That's, sometimes these cards get stuck together. <clears throat> Bryce Elder. You Darvish. Got destroyed. I think yesterday. A crazy high ERA. Stephen Kwan. Also, speaking of which, uh, I have Hunter Brown, and his ERA was in the hundreds. So, <laughs> absolutely ruined my uh, fantasy team. But, uh, all right. Last stack should have the numbered and probably the patch in it. So, here we go. So here is stack number two. Now, oddly enough, I do not see a thicker card in here. So uh, we might be getting another auto, which would be insane. That would bring us up to four autos. Um, but we'll see. Maybe I just missed it. But all right, here we go. We have um, a numbered card coming up. Try to not reveal that. It's pretty difficult, though. <laughs> All right, let's see. Uh, that's going to be Gary Sanchez, catcher. Got that nice prominent uh, position down there just in case you didn't know what a catcher does normally. All right, so put that up there. Let's see. Walsh's Game Time Slam. All right. Chris Bryant. And there it is. It is another auto. That is crazy. So these two boxes have produced three autos, um, which was what I predicted I would get in the entire case. So now we're up four, up to four, and Shane Bieber. That's awesome. So we got Shane Bieber, Jose Altuve, Mike Schmidt from this from this rip. That's crazy. <clears throat> All right, so let's see what else we got in here. Not expecting a whole lot. Hopefully we can get uh, J-Rod, which he's not uh, not been having the greatest season so far. Hopefully he'll pick up pick it up soon. Bobby Witt, he's having a good season. And Spencer Torkelson, I'm not really sure how he's doing. Alec Thomas, let's see... All right, last stack here. Thanks for joining me. Would like a uh, like on this video. Subscribe to the channel, please. It'll help me out in the algorithm. There's George Kirby and another Bobby Witt. So there's that collation there. George Kirby, Bobby Witt. And Juan Soto. 
Let's see. So I don't know, maybe the uh, the variations and errors are much more rare than I would have anticipated. C.J. Abrams. And Mackenzie Gore. So I will go ahead and check for any error cards. Get this nice stack from our two hobby box or our second hobby box here that we ripped. Um, so here we go. Uh, done error checking um, didn't get a single error or variation card that I'm aware of um, but that's okay I mean we got three autos and I wouldn't say insignificant autos either I mean these are some pretty nice autos to get um, really love to get the Altuve auto nice to get a vet and got Mackenzie Gore on the numbered got this uh, nice stack of good rookie cards including Bobby Witt Jr. and J-Rod C.J. Abrams um, but uh, yeah, the second uh, rip has been a major success. Um, definitely liking my decision to stick with uh, a case of this rather than uh, basically one hobby bo or jumbo box of uh, Bowman. So anyway, thanks for joining me and I will catch you on part three coming up uh, probably within the next week or so. All right. Thanks. <laughs>